Hi everyone, Paul Levy with Brown Owls, and this week we've got some more new products. First up, from Tipton, we have their stand-up gun vise. This, uh, obviously it's not stand-up right now, uh, but you can obviously put it on your workbench just like this. It's super rigid. You can see they've got uh, steel construction, this tubing down below, and you can pop out these legs, so you can basically have it in your shop uh, fully standing up if you don't have a workbench handy. Or if you do uh, and it's cluttered, you can <laughs> use this instead. Uh, so has locking clamps on either end. Of course, you can tighten it to the body itself or you can take this uh, clamp off entirely by loosening this portion and swap it out if you say only need one. You can adjust the height of it with this knob over here, bring it up and down. And then it's got these soft jaws right here that are obviously rubberized and then they can't and will conform uh, to whatever you're working on. Of course, those adjust on either side. Rubberized on the bottom too, so you're not digging up uh, your gun or whatever else you might be working on. Has these included trays, which are handy for tossing your spare parts. You can take these on and off as needed. Uh, the center portion, again, you can take this on and off with this adjustable knob. And this is meant for your AR-15. Uh, so this goes inside of your magazine well uh, and this right here is pretty handy. You can close this down once you get your AR-15 inserted and you can actually function check your trigger. It'll hit this device right here and won't damage your lower receiver. So pretty handy. And then otherwise you got, of course, on the other end, another vise and a handy feature, which actually they don't call out. On the end right here, they've got cleaning rod storage. So you can insert your cleaning rod through either end. It can hold two cleaning rods. That's always a tough item to store and get out of the way. Uh, just toss those inside uh, and you got storage for your two cleaning rods. So that's the Tipton stand-up gun vise. Get out of the way. The next up from lockdown, we have the puck. This is uh, intended for your favorite firearm safe. So what this does is monitor the activity essentially of your safe. So that's whether the door is open or closed, but also temperature and humidity. So pretty handy and motion, I should say. So uh, you open it up, it gives you some nice clear instructions. There's the app. I couldn't connect to the Wi-Fi here. Uh, you, it is designed to use your home Wi-Fi. So you've got your door activity, motion, uh, you've got your temperature, humidity, and you can also set warnings on it. So if that humidity gets to a certain level, it'll message your phone with a heads up. So here's the device itself. There's the puck. Uh, this is actually a screen on the front. So if you turn it on, it'll give you some uh, fairly basic activity. There's trying to sync with something. It does take four uh, AA batteries, uh, which are easy to install. It also can charge via USB cable, which is included. And it has this handy bracket on the back. So you can mount this to the inside of your safe or something else that you might want to monitor. And then it'll simply slide right on after the fact and secure and be in place out of the way. So that's the puck itself. It does, again, it come with a few other things. Uh, really nice packaging on this. You got your USB cable, battery info, uh, and then this is for your door magnet. So you attach this to your door uh, and then this can sense whether or not it's open or shut. So that's the lockdown puck. And then new from Smith & Wesson, we have their lower receiver and upper receiver parts kits. This is obviously a popular item at Brownells, and we've got another offering for you. So first up right here, we've got their lower receiver parts kit, less the trigger components. This is uh, the type of kit that most people buy because uh, they'll, they'll want to customize or select uh, an aftermarket trigger from one of our other vendors. Uh, so this is pretty handy when you're building out your AR-15 lower receiver. It has all those components you need, and it's from a brand like Smith & Wesson, so pretty neat. Right here, we've got the AR Essential Kit. This is more of like a repair kit or something you wanna have, maybe in your range bag, some stuff that might commonly uh, break or install wrong or, or go flying. Uh, that's a handy little backup kit right there. And then, also if you're buying upper receivers from Brownells, a lot of them are stripped. You're gonna need something like this. This is an upper receiver completion kit. You've got your ejection port uh, cover uh, components. You got the ejection port cover, the rod, you got the spring for that, and then you got your forward assist uh, and spring and roll pin to retain that. So when you're picking up an upper, make sure you grab one of these too. That's new from Smith & Wesson. That's it for this week. I'll see you again next week.